in here and you can see yeah I've got the sample set to five which is actually quite high anyway there you go you can see that we've got a Z buffer information in there as well so we set that back have a look at some of the other passes that are in there as well so I chose the visual effects course because I was always interested in movie magic as a kid and I was always trying to figure out how they did the explosions or the green screen work. So I was looking around for courses and I found this one and it was a welcoming environment and they had a bunch of facilities, a green screen studio and everything. So it just made sense to pick this course. So what we're trying to do here is building up all of these layers. We've got our diffuse, it's the base colour. You've got your specula, it's going to pick up all those highlights. If you think about a shiny surface, um, a reflective glass or something, you get those lovely highlights. VFX is across lots of different industries, from film to games to virtual reality, theme park rides. It encompasses things like programming, animation, creating creatures, it's building destruction, it's fire, it's oceans, it can be so many different things. When we use hard light, we use it to sort of really provide definition. So I, I mentioned the shadows earlier, but actually shadows can be really useful because shadows are the things that let us really see like the detail to where soft light actually washes all of that out. The reason I chose the VFX course was mainly because I wanted to create that fake environment because I wanted to make people feel like they are living in that world, like a dream that you cannot find anywhere in the real world. So we've got this that you can follow along with as well. We have very, very good connections with huge international companies. They advise us, they help us with assignment briefs, they look at our curriculum, make sure that we're keeping it on point, we're keeping it updated. We're really about trying to get students into industry. Mm -hmm. 